Hi all, welcome to my channel, welcome to my world, this is The World Away. I couldn't resist making this video today. Uh, because of the joys of TikTok scrolling through, I saw a gadget which I thought, I must have that, and I actually bought this for myself. I'm not affiliated with this company at all, but this is one of the most ingenious things I've seen. It's going to make my life, and perhaps yours, a little bit easier in the modelling world. I'm going to show you the Green Stuff World Brush Rinser. Now, I'm not joking, when I actually saw this on TikTok, I was absolutely fascinated for you. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna build this together for you here, show you what it's like, I'm gonna show you how it works, then you can see how useful this actually is. So let's start building it now. Now, this is the box it comes in. There is a uh, link in the video description where I actually bought this from, uh, but it um, leaves a lot to be desired with the instructions. So I've already done a test fit of how this goes together. So I just took everything out of the box here. I did get a 10% uh, off voucher here and a nice little sticker from Green Stuff World. Now the instructions leave a lot to be desired. This is what it's going to look like when it's done. Uh, but it doesn't really tell you how to put the thing together. It just tells you how to put the reservoir on top and that's it. So I had to figure that out for myself. So let me show you how this is built. So it comes with a base and it comes with a top for the base here. The first thing we need to do is we need to actually start a button pressing here that's going to release the reservoir here. And the parts for that they give us are this, this, this actually comes off there, a spring and a screw. <laughs> so I had to figure this out for myself. So basically this rubber little top here is going to go above this plastic lever just like this. Make sure it's nice and flush there. I turn over the base and I make sure that this has got two holes on this side. It's going to go over these two sections just like that there. Then I've got the screw which is a silver self-tapping screw. Oops, which I've dropped and it's a steel one. Doesn't want to be picked up in my uh, screwdriver by the look of it. So I will hold that into the position it's going to go and get that screwed in. Now it needs to be in quite tight so that then that reservoir there can hold water without water leaking out of it. All that's left to do then is just to put this plunger in. So it's simple to actually make, but uh, on the end of this button, we do have a little fork. That's just gonna clip into the circle we've got there. So I'm gonna put that through this side, line it up, and then holding this together, just push that in like that. So now that's attached to this. So every time I press this button now, the reservoir is gonna release water there. Ingenious, right. All that leaves us to do now is to actually put the reservoir on. So this is actually gonna be fitting on just like that. This is what the reservoir looks like, as you can see, and we do have a top for that, which looks just like that. So put that on, make sure it's on enough. And you can see we've got a little lip on this side. I haven't got that on the other side. So that little edge there, is going to go into this section here. So what I'm going to do is lie that down like this, probably best on the top camera, and I'll flip it over in one go. And as you can see, that's now filled up that reservoir. <laughs> okay, now I'm just going to put that to one side. I'm going to show you the magic. So what I used to use is just any of my old trays from some of the builds, and I'll just put some of this uh, paint in the tray there, just a little bit. And then later on, I'm gonna paint with some yellow there. So I've already got my paint palette here. I have been using just two random colors, red and yellow. How does this work? So I've been painting away with some of my yellow paint here, as you can see, la da 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 da. Now I wanna paint red, so I need to clean my brush. You ready for the magic now? So I just put it in this reservoir, and as you can see, I just clean that like that. So I've now got a clean brush. But oh no, that water is absolutely filthy. I need to have clean water in there. All I do, you ready for this? Push the button, it drains, and then it refills itself again. How cool is that? So now I'm ready to use a fresh color. So this time, I'm gonna use some uh, red, just painting some red here. La -di -da, -di da di da Oh no, I want to go back to yellow again. So, clean my brush, just like this. As you can see, 
This is ingenious. Oh no, we've got dirty water again. So I press the button, drains the water, and then it refills it again. How is this not something that is commonplace in the model space workshop? Look at it. So once again, painting with some yellow. Oh no, I want to change the brush color. It's got some little raised sections here so I can put my brush along there. And you haven't got to do it each color you do. Look, say I've just got some red in there. Clean the brush off. Brush is clean. I want to change the water. Press the button, water drains, and then fills up with nice fresh water again. <laughs> this is absolutely brilliant. It's not very expensive as well. I think I paid £13 for this. So uh, the brush rinser from Green World Stuff is something that I didn't realise I need, but when I'm actually doing miniature paintings or model painting, I'm fed up of having to keep changing the water. And having this, I can just leave that now like that. It's absolutely brilliant. And obviously when it comes time to changing the reservoir or changing the water, I just take the top off and pour that away. Simples. But uh, you'll have to let me know what you think of that absolutely simple gadget. I just thought it was fascinating when I saw it and I wanted to share that with you. But I really hope you liked that video. If you did, please remember to give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed already, please remember to subscribe. Other than that, take care.